in character, in studio. You guys look awesome. So great. <laughs> Thank you. Thank, Thank you. Me. Yes, to of be course. Here. We appreciate you being here so early. <laughs> okay, so what are you guys dressed up for? Tell us all about it. Yes. Alrighty, so I am dressed as the snowflakey princess. I love it. And she, in our show Dances with Trolls, is opening a charm school. And she wants holiday helpers. <laughs> so she recruits two trolls to help her deal with the holiday doings. Because she's so busy, probably, right? Absolutely. <laughs> she's a princess. She's got lots to do. So, as you can imagine, hilarity ensues. I bet. I love it. <laughs> what, what about, about you? Elle, I'll be uh, hosting uh, our evening adult show called You'll Be Naughty Too. Oh! And, uh, <laughs> and so it's a wonderful combination of cabaret, singing, music, uh, circus, comedy, wow. and all rolled together. And that opens next Thursday and runs for two weekends. So kind of tell us about your theater, because you guys are part of the Indie Give campaign, correct? Yes, that's right. Yeah, so kind yes. of tell us, how, how is that Indie Give campaign going to help you guys? So we're a small nonprofit, and... Uh, We've been part of the Indie Give campaign since it started 11 years ago. And each year we raise money for, uh, uh, primarily for our children's programming, Dances with Trolls Carla. and the Snowflake <laughs> Princess. So uh, each year we do about 150 shows at the theater. Wow, so that is busy. a lot. And, uh, and that money uh, that we raise through Indie Give helps our children's programming as well as our educational outreach and also our summer camps. We do about 14 different summer camps each summer, so all that money goes to support that. When you're helping these kids, I think uh, some people don't realize theater is so important to have when you're growing up. Yes. It's, it brings out a whole different element to kids. Kind of talk to us about that a little bit. Well, my favorite thing about theater is that it's, it's the best art form because it encompasses all of the art forms. So there's something for everybody. If you don't act, you can design a set. If you don't know how to design a set, there's music, mm -hmm. there's dancing, performance yeah. art, dancing, there's so much that you can be exposed to through theater and it certainly changed my life growing up, which is why I continue to, to work in it and pursue it and it's so rewarding and to see that the kids enjoy it like they do, it's such a gift. Wow. It's wonderful uh, because we're a small theater. It's many times the uh, child's first experience with live theater. And we only seat 100, so the kids are very close to the stage, to the show, to the action. <laughs> Sometimes the actors are coming right <laughs> through the audience. And, uh, <laughs> uh, and so it's, it's really a, a wonderful way for them to be introduced to the performing arts. Now, how can people get a hold of you guys if they want to come to the, the upcoming shows? You said you have two shows tonight, correct? That's right. We have two shows today. Uh, uh, at uh, 1 o'clock and 3 o'clock, yeah. Okay, and, and how did they get tickets? Oh, well, you can go on our website, themat.org. You can give our box office a call at 719-465-6321. Awesome, and most importantly, if you guys want to help give out to their Give Indie campaign, we have a link to that on our website at fox21news.com. You just go on there, click their browse uh, categories, and you can find them and help them out. Of course. Thank you all so much for being here with us. morning. We very much appreciate it. Thank yes. you all. Oh, thank you. Of course. Oh, goodness. We've got still some more news to come. It is 6.45 a.m. on this Sunday. We will be right back.